Hi, I'm Harley Pasternak, and welcome to my Hollywood workout. Single workouts are my celebrity proven 25 minute workouts. Is this your first Hollywood workout? Select one of these single workouts to get started. This workout gave the back and shoulders my client needed to become a superhero in one of their film projects. Hold the Wii Remote in your right hand with the buttons facing towards you. Follow along with the arrows as they appear on screen. All right, are you ready for today's workout? I know I am. Now clear the space around you and make sure you've got plenty of room to work out safely. We're gonna start with a warm up, do some strength exercise, and finish it off with some cardio to cool down. Along the way, I'll be checking to make sure you're following, doing the exercises properly. Get ready for an awesome workout. Let's get started. Let's get the body moving by going into a nice jog. All right, so we're gonna keep the weight on the toes, gonna keep pumping those elbows and arms forward and back. Now for me, visualization is a big tip on this one. Picture yourself somewhere that you really wanna be. Is it a beach? Is it a forest? Is it running up a mountain? And visualize yourself jogging towards something. And keep swinging your arms, feel your heart rate slowly getting up there. And when it's up there, keep it up there. You don't have to sprint. There's nowhere you're in a rush to get. It's just about keeping your body moving forward. Keep yourself light on your toes, head up, swing those elbows, feel yourself breathe throughout this exercise. You can also feel yourself a little bit of twisting through your midsection. Activate your core. Keep going and swing in your arms. Now for me, it's about a beach. I like jogging down that beach, looking out towards the ocean on the right-hand side as I keep swinging my arms back and forth. You've got 15 seconds left. Keep going, push yourself straight through this one, drive yourself towards the end, keep pumping those arms, lifting those knees up. You've got five seconds and you're almost there. Keep going, three, two, one, and done. All right, let's warm up our core with some trunk crosses. Now here's what I love about this exercise. What you're gonna do is you're gonna cross your body, bring your opposite elbow to your opposite knee. As we bring it back and across our body, we keep twisting and squeezing through our core and our midsection. We're gonna be using a few different abdominal exercises here and a few different muscle groups at the same time. So every time we bring it back and across our body, you're gonna feel your obliques, which are the sides or the love handle area. You're also gonna feel the rectus abdominis, which are the abs in your front. But most importantly, we're gonna be using a midsection muscle called the transverse abdominis. It's also called your corset muscle. And it's involved in twisting or rotation of the trunk. And every time that we come across our body and we bring your opposite knee to our opposite elbow, make sure you're twisting your body in opposite direction. So as your lower body twists right, your upper body twists left and vice versa. Keep going, keep yourself twisting through your body, strong core, strong midsection, keep your heart rate elevated, listen to your body and feel your body getting leaner. Five seconds on four, three, two, one, and done. Jumping jacks. All right, now, this is a great cardio movement when you do this because you're working your upper body, your lower body, you're bringing blood to the shoulders, you're bringing blood to the abductors or the abductors, those hip muscles on the outside. Quads, we're bringing blood to the knees, to the hips, and it is really intense. You probably feel your heart rate getting up right now. You feel your blood pumping, you feel that fat beating from your skin, from your muscles, from your organs, your body core temperature is getting up. And you wanna think about the two positions as you do this when you do the jumping jacks. You're creating the letter X and you're creating the letter I. So here we are in the letter X and back to the letter I as you do this. Keep going through these. And as you do these, you can have a little fun with them. You know, if you just wanna kinda of rotate as you do these, that's okay to do. Up and down, breathe through them. 
Don't stop. And also, listen to your body. If your joints hurt, jump a little lower. If, you're jump, if your, your knees or your ankles hurt, maybe just move that upper body. You're almost there. Keep pushing through it. You've got five, four, three, two, one more, and relax. Insert the Wii Remote into your right pocket, pointed down, and with the buttons facing outwards. All right, this one's an ode to my youth growing up in Canada playing ice hockey. It's called Ice Skaters. Cardio kick butt, here we go. Cross your body, tap the ground. Cross your body, tap the ground. Now this movement not only is a great cardio movement, but I'm not gonna lie, you will feel your legs, you will feel your hips, you will feel your butt as you do this exercise. Now, from a variety perspective, build yourself up to this. At first, maybe you can't go as far across your body, maybe it's modified, maybe you just bring it a little bit across your body, and maybe instead of touching the ground every rep, maybe you're actually coming close to the ground. And as you become better at these, you can pick up the pace a bit, you can actually touch the ground and reach your back leg further across the room. And when you cross those planes, you get to work so many butt and hip muscles that you normally don't work in regular squats and regular lunges. Keep going, feel that heart rate rise. We're gonna do a couple more each side. We're almost there. Tap it out and relax. All right, that might be even better than I can do. Way to be consistent. Hold the Wii Remote in your right hand with the buttons facing towards you. All right, time to sculpt the arms. Now we're gonna train the bicep and the brachioradialis. This exercise here is called the hammer curl. I want you to stand feet shoulder width apart. You're gonna have your arms down at your side and I want your palms turned in facing towards each other. Grab your gear, head up, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna curl those arms straight up towards each other, bringing your hands towards your shoulder. Are you ready? Make sure you breathe through this one. And here we go. Curl and stretch. And every time you do this, make sure that you breathe with the movement. You know, I always use a saying, whistle while you work. So when you bring your arms up and you bring the gear up, you wanna make sure that you breathe out on the way up and breathe in on the way down. It's a really important thing to do so your blood pressure doesn't get too high and you keep having the energy and the stamina to continue through this motion. Now, this works the bicep, and the bicep is in the front of the arm. Bi stands for two, sep stands for head. So there's two heads to the bicep. It also works the brachioradialis, and the brachioradialis is right on the front of the forearm, and it's a really important exercise. You wanna have a strong grip, so you can open those jars of pickles that you never could before. Keep going, you're almost there. Stretch, squeeze, feel that burn straight through the front of the arm without stopping. Keep moving through this one. Keep pushing yourself on five, four, three, two, and done. Let's bring together a few more with that kind of effort and you will be in red carpet shape in no time. Insert the Wii Remote into your right pocket, point it down, and with the buttons facing. Now this next one is an advanced movement. I'm warning you, your legs will catch on fire. That's the burning that you're gonna feel. You're also gonna feel your heart rate racing a lot. This is a jump squat. Listen to your body. If your knees are sore, your lower back sore, stop, catch your breath, and modify this one without getting off the ground. So feet shoulder width apart, just like we do for a squat. We're gonna go down, we're gonna drop our butt as low as our knee height, okay? And we're gonna come up off the ground. Are you ready? Let's do these. We're gonna go down and up without stopping. So we're also gonna let our upper body be really loose and relaxed as we do this. All right, you're gonna feel your glutes. You're gonna feel your quads. You're gonna feel all of your lower body, but you're also gonna feel your heart. Feel like it's jumping out of your chest. Now keep going. Dig deep when you do this. Keep breathing. You're gonna get pretty anaerobic through this one. Heart's racing right now more than it does for normal exercises. Keep driving through your heels. Good. You're doing great. The more you push through your heels, the more it's about your glutes. Keep going. 
keep pushing. Don't stop. Yeah, keep going, no stopping. I'll join you for these last few. Oh, gosh, I hate I actually have to do something. Oh, let's drive through these. We've only got a few left. You ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Wow, now that was a set.